Hi, Alex here. Today I would like to show you uh, the verb estar, which means to be. Okay, but in Portuguese we have two verbs to express to be. One of them is estar, and we are going to check it out today. Let's go. So that's how it's written: estar, estar, to be. And here the conjugation. Eu estou, I am, eu estou, I am. Tu, you, singular, estás, tu estás. Ele, he, she, ela, está. Nós, we, are, nós estamos, nós estamos. Vocês, you all. Estão, you are, vocês estão, you plural, estão, vocês estão. Eles, they masculine, elas, they feminine, estão. It's the same form for vocês, plural, and uh, eles e elas, plural. Ok? Estão, estão. Now I'm going to show you some sentences. Eu estou aqui. Eu estou aqui. I am here. Aqui. Here. Eu estou aqui. I am here. Tu estás triste. Tu estás triste. You are sad. You are sad. Ele ou ela está Ele ou ela está viajando. He or she is traveling. Traveling, right? He or she is traveling. Ele ou ela está viajando. OK? Plural. We are here. We are here. Nós estamos aqui. We are here. Vocês, you all, estão tristes. Vocês estão tristes. Tu estás triste, singular. Vocês, plural. The adjective must accord, must agree with the plural pronoun. Ok? I'll talk about it in the next lessons. Eles ou elas estão viajando. Eles ou elas estão viajando. They are traveling. Note that in Portuguese, we have uh, the gerund in three different forms. Okay? I will also approach the subject in next videos. But just for the sake of it, this one, viajar, the ones that end in AR, the gerund is ANDO, ando, estão viajando. I am speaking, eu estou falando, speaking. Ok? That comes from the verb falar, eu estou falando. Right? That's enough for today, folks. Uh, I hope you have understood it. And I will make more videos about uh, this kind of sentences, right, with star, and also with ser, which is the other form of to be in Portuguese, okay? Stay tuned, subscribe, I'll see you around.